Hello um, and welcome. My name is Daniel Agnew. I'm a teddy bear specialist and this is Hilary Pawley, Hello. who's a teddy bear collector and we're in her wonderful barn which is full of teddy bears. And we've, well, we've selected two of our favourite German teddy bears made by quite unusual companies. So you have... I've got a Peter Sussenguth with his wonderful um, teeth and tongue, which I suppose might be quite frightening for a child, but um, most unusual, very rare. I suppose that's a good approach in there as well, isn't so it? So this is composition. It's a composition nose. Yeah, this has got a composition head covered in fur. And he's got quite distinctive eyes, not like um, the eyes that we normally see on, t on teddy bears. So altogether, he's quite unusual. I think probably quite rare, isn't he? They are. What happened with these, that um, no one really had saw any of them at all. And then in the 1970s, someone found a stash of them in a warehouse that had never been sold. So they found about 300 bears, and quite a lot of them were in their boxes. And so they have now been distributed all over the world in collections. So there are no more than those 300 bears around. And he's called Peter, so he often has a chest tag there, which has got a metal rim on it. And you it's can see Peter. where it was. And Susan Guth was the maker. And he's got this lovely brown-tipped white mohair. And it's one of my favourite bears that you can get, I think, personally. Mm. I'd love to own one of those. Um, so they do turn up from time to time, but they're always highly sought after because there's so few of them around. Now, they did do a reproduction of this in the 1990s, I think, but it's not as delicate. And so, you know, be careful when buying them. Um, and you've just got to have this finer, delicate feel to your Susan Guth um, before parting with money, I would suggest. Well, you know me, when I've got one, I usually want two or three, don't I? Yeah, so be careful, <laughs> yes. Lyric. But you, now you've got to look for one with the badge, and, and yes. the, bo the box turns up quite often as well, so yeah. that's nice to have. Whereas I've selected one of my favourite of your um, German bears, and this is a Struns. And what I love about this chap, particularly, is that he's got a, a what's known as gutter percha nose. And now the, uh, the, rod, the Steiff rod bears originally had a, a gutter percha nose and it always, always flakes off and disappears. So it's very rare to have a gutter percha nose. And so that, because it, it's made of a sort of an organic material that sort of dries over time, it crumbles and just falls off naturally. There's nothing you can do about it. So for that to survive, you're obviously looking after it particularly carefully. Thank you. I find, I find strands really difficult to identify, apart from usually they have great big feet. Well, I, I don't find them easy. Well, strands were a big rival of Steiff, and they copied Steiff quite considerably. So they do have um, a, a Steiff look about them. Um, and so, but they did change their style quite a lot. And no one is 100% certain what strands is. There are a few that we're fairly certain. But there's lots of other bears that get attributed to Struns. Um, so, so it is a bit of a... No labels, uh, no buttons. They no. did have a button. They did, did have a... They had a, a, a... I think it's octagonal button in the left ear. Like Steiff. And they were sued about that as well. Yeah, yeah. They literally... Every time Steiff bought something out, they copied it. Mm. So they were a bit naughty. But they, they make some beautiful bears. And, and you know, they're very rare. And this is lovely. This is a white one. Mm. Well, they, he's discoloured a bit, but... I think he's absolutely he's adorable. He's very squashy. He, he's, yeah. he's lost a little bit of... No, but that's, that's what makes him lovely sometimes, yeah. I think, personally. Yeah. So he's And wooden, gorgeous. presumably, eyes. Yeah, boot button eyes, boot button yeah. Wooden one. So two rare German teddy bears. Thank you. Thank you.